You open your brand new MacBook. The screen shines, everything runs lightning fast, but one question immediately comes to mind. Which apps should you use for documents, spreadsheets, and presentations? On one side, the classic choice, Microsoft Office with Word, Excel, and PowerPoint. On the other, Apple's free apps, Pages, Numbers, and Keynote. These are two different worlds. Today, we'll find out which one is better for you. Microsoft Office is available as a full version for Mac, ready to download directly from the App Store. You can install Word, Excel, and PowerPoint just like on Windows, and they work smoothly within Mac OS. For many users, this is a natural choice. If you've spent years working with Office on Windows, switching to the Mac version feels almost seamless. The interface is slightly adapted to Apple's design language, but the core tools remain the same. And that's the real strength here, familiarity. Decades of habits, shortcuts, and workflows don't have to be relearned. You can continue creating documents, building spreadsheets, and preparing presentations exactly as you did before without compromise. Microsoft Office for Mac is available as a full version in the App Store, but it isn't free. To unlock Word, Excel, and PowerPoint, you'll need either a Microsoft 365 subscription or a one-time purchase, which can be more expensive and doesn't include future major updates. Now let's look at the other side. Apple gives you Pages, Numbers, and Keynote for free. Just download them from the App Store and they're yours. The biggest advantage is simplicity. In Pages, everything is set up so you can start writing immediately. Minimal distractions, maximum clarity. Numbers doesn't try to be Excel. It's designed for clean reports and visualization. Tables look neat and charts are created in just a few clicks. Keynote is a favorite among designers. Animations, smooth transitions, elegant themes. All of this makes presentations not dry, but vivid and memorable. If you don't need hundreds of extra features and value a clean, focused interface, Apple's apps can feel like a real breath of fresh air. Another huge advantage is the ecosystem. You start writing a text in pages on your Mac. On the way home, you open it on your iPhone. In the evening, you finish it on your iPad. Everything syncs automatically through iCloud. Collaboration is just as simple. Share a link and your colleague can edit the document right away. No subscriptions, no complicated logins, no extra setup. It all works straight out of the box. Here's the secret. You don't have to choose just one. Many people keep both Office and Apple's apps on their Mac. A complex report for colleagues? Use Excel. A quick note for yourself or a presentation with stunning effects? Pages and Keynote. And Apple's apps can export to Microsoft formats. Write a text in Pages, save it as Word, and your colleague gets the familiar .docx file. It all depends on your tasks. Are you a student? For essays and term papers, the free Apple apps will be more than enough. Do you work as an analyst or a lawyer? Microsoft Office will be more reliable. Are you a creative professional, a blogger, or a designer? Keynote and Pages will suit you best. And most importantly, the decision isn't final. Today, Office may feel more convenient. Tomorrow, you can try Apple's apps. Nothing stops you from changing your approach to fit the task. Microsoft Office or Apple Apps, it's not a battle with a winner. It's a choice of tools. And the best one is the one that helps you personally. Don't be afraid to try. Use both. Experiment. And over time, you'll find the balance that makes your Mac a true working tool, not just a beautiful laptop.